you know, after all that, I got my little uh, forty-dollar pressure washer out. Um, washed her up. Got all the doo-doo off it. All the mud. It's ready to go to pissers now and get pisserized. It's gonna fabricate a plow up for me. I'm checking out some online. They're real heavy in price. So, uh, yeah, tore that sticker. Oh well, got plenty of them. Nice and clean for you, pisser. Speaking about pisser in the hack and pack shop, I took this truck to him probably. Well, it's going to go on a year in January, and uh, he put these SS stripes on for me at his old hack and pack shop, and they are uh, holding out. Nice, Look at that custom work, custom SS stripes on a Sonoma. I like that. But anyways, uh, you guys have been hanging with me and been my subscribers for a while. Know what I'm talking about. Uh, if not, you guys check out Pisser's channel. Um, he's here on YouTube. That's what it's called. Pisser's channel. Type it in. You'll find him. Sean will uh, subscribe to you, I'm sure. He subscribed to him. But he did the work on this. I got a, uh, a fender that was uh, shaking like hell today cold after washing the four-wheeler but uh the fender was uh, blue hood was blue he matched it right in for me can't even really t can't tell at all or he blended it you look at it any way you want you just can't tell I just rinsed it off seeing that was the last time I was going to use the uh, pressure washer for the year but yeah this whole side was hit at one time and you look down through there, you can't see anyways where he blended it. And he blended it right into this door. Because uh, you just can't buy the paint uh, 11 years old and make it match after being sun faded and stuff. So he had to do his little uh, pisser thing to it, you know, to make it just right. He got a pissed in it or something, I don't know. But he's good, man, he really is. And uh, speaking of pisser again... This is going to him because he's got some work to do there. If you do subscribe to him, you'll see him be fixing this over the winter for me. Actually, hopefully it's before winter. Got to get this done, man. Keep saying that, but it's money hasn't been right. So here it sits. If you ain't got the money, what can you do, right? It's bought and paid for, so it ain't going anywhere. But thing is, uh, I want it done. This side ain't as bad, but he's going to have to do the same work over here. Other than that, underneath this truck, solid. I don't understand why they rot here, but the frame and everything is so solid on this thing. It's not even funny. It runs so good. Again, this is how I bought the other truck. Cheap and repaired. Had a fender bender with it. Deer something. New hood and fender. Well, the grill's still a little messed up in it. But, what are you going to do? Go to it goes to pissers. I got some stuff to get like these things up here. So pisser, if you see him out there, man, I gotta stop shaking today. I'm in them corners. I was telling you, I'm missing on each side up here. Gotta get them. Wait, Sean, it will be coming to you. I promise, buddy. I'll be getting the four wheel over to you. I gotta wait for my Google check now, and uh, I'll be getting that over to you. So you guys can check out the videos at the shop. I'll be there getting videos. He'll have videos. Uh, Fabricating a plow up on a Polaris Magnum 4x4 and uh, getting this thing done. Hey, who are you? It's Recky Dog. Alright, this thing hasn't been started in God over a month. 130,000 miles on it. That's what the Sonoma has on it now. Got it with 119, it's got 130 on it now. Wow, dead. Should have started it. Battery's dead. What a bummer, huh? Yeah, like I said, I should have started it before, but I didn't. I'll get her charged in here. There we go. Click back to two amp. Damn 
charger. Does its does its own thing. I don't know why. Not a right connection. There we go. Bad connection. That's what it was. Make her up to 15 amp. I'll charge for a little bit. That sucks. I think I checked it before it started snowing though. Sonoma hasn't been started in like three or four days, but this thing's been so faithful to us, it's not even funny. Not even funny. But when I put a water pump in it, breaks so far. Other than this thing, the little girl's been good to us. The window's been open. Another one with 130,000 miles. Right. I have my knee on the seat. This thing's been good to us. Trying to warm it up. Rex says, oh, this one's started. Can I get in that one? Can you leave it in that one? This will take a while to go back down and come back up. Close to normal. I'm about to use battery for this at the junkyard, but what are you going to do, right? Used. Got all dirty. Got my CV in here. So I can talk to Pugs1. My Cobra. Love this thing. Talked to quite a few people on it so far. Wait for Pistons to get his hooked up so we can talk. Hey, buddy. Pass him in the trash can. <laughs> Rex remember that. Yeah, it's still charging, so. Should have enough to get started, anyways. Definitely wrong key. Ain't gonna start with that one. Everything seems to work except for the gas gauge. That always stays on full. Thinking it's a ground. I gotta get underneath there and try to fix it. Maybe we can do that at the pisser shop while he's there. We we'll add a ground to it. See if there's an access door to it. Brake light stays on. I got the door open, so ABS light is on. ABS is actually unplugged. It's a seatbelt light. Well, even on miles now. It's time to get this one on the road and start breaking them even. I love the sound system in this one, though. Make okay, good factory radio. Oh, God. Back seat folded down. This thing runs so smooth, though. It runs really good. Good to have them both on at once. Plug that for right now. I'm gonna put a full charge on that battery. Just want to start it real quick. Somebody cut the AC wire. Plug in the AC pump. Free though. Works. Seems like it. I get the right plug for it. I get that too, sister. Get a chance when you're there. Plug. <laughs> a lot of oxidization on stuff there. Moving apart, it's had to be used. Good running truck though. Can't wait. Touch tone four wheel drive works men on it. If I didn't put the pressure washer away, I'd take it out in the field for you real quick and show you how well it works. The tires are about bald though. We're gonna get some meters for it, some diggers. Small season diggers. Nothing that hums or anything. It sounds good, looks good. Hopefully some raised white letters on them is my goal. 235, 75, 15s are coming down on price, so 
That's what comes stock on these things. Gotta pull my lights up and get the freaking uh, mower put away today. That's next on the agenda.